here. Look at those teeth. Look at those stripes. With a little fizzy slime magic. Fizzy fun house. Whoa, Fizzy! What is it, Phoebe? This dinosaur seems really upset. Maybe you can ask him what's wrong. Oh, okay. Hi, dinosaur. What's wrong? <coughs> well, well, what did he say? He said he lost all of his dinosaur friends. They just zoomed away. Are you able to help him? Of course I am. With a little fizzy slime magic. Oh, I love this. Fizzy, wizzy, bo-bizzy, bop! Whoa, Fizzy, that looks like some slimy fun! But, uh, I don't see any racing dinosaurs! That's because they're in the slime! Miss Hands, give us a hand! I'm happy to help. Hi, everyone, it's me, Miss Hands, and let's dig into this dinosaur slime. Up first, we have this pink slime with this red dino on top. It's so squishy. Look at all the colors inside. Its head just got really big. Okay, that's a lot of fun, but we need to check this slime for dinosaurs. Let's see what's inside. I see dinosaurs, but are these racing dinosaurs? We have a red dinosaur. Roar, roar! Here's a green dinosaur. Roar, roar! And here's a flying pterodactyl dinosaur. Roar, roar, roar! And it landed in the slime. But uh, I don't see any racing dinosaurs. That's because the slime is very magical. Cover up those little dinosaurs in the slime and see what happens. Okay, Fizzy. We're going to take these three dinosaurs and cover them up with slime. And now we're gonna squeeze this and see what happens. Whoa! What is under all this slime? Look at this beak here. It looks like it's a pterodactyl on wheels. Let's watch it go. Here it comes again and again. It looks so super duper cool, but we need to find more of these. So let's see what's in this green slime with a green dinosaur on top. Let's see if we can make the head really big. Whoa, there goes the head. Time to see what's in this slime. We found more dinosaurs. Hey, here's a green dinosaur. I think it wants to jump in the slime. We have a blue dinosaur. Roar! Jumping in the slime. And it looks like we have a T-Rex. This T-Rex is gray. Roar! And it's going in the slime. Okay, they're in the slime, but I really need to cover them with this slime and see what we make when we squeeze this squishy. Okay, let's see. I see wheels. What is under all this slime? Look at these spiky scales here. And whoa, look at that head. We have found another racing dinosaur. Let's watch it go. Whoa, so fast. There it goes. Look at these red spikes up here and it has lots of green on it. Super cool. Let's find some more. This time we have blue slime and our big T-Rex friend is on top. Roar! Let's see what's in the blue slime. Look at all the dinosaurs. I see lots of blue dinosaurs. Up first, we have this blue T-Rex. Roar! Jumping in the slime. Here's another blue dinosaur. Roar, roar! 
jumping in the slime. And another one. <laughs> Look at this guy. And I think he wants to jump in the slime. But let's go ahead and cover these guys up with all of this slime down here. And I can't really squish this guy, but I can close and open, close and open, close and open, close and open his mouth. And what? Two dinosaurs? Let's get them out from under all of this blue slime. Look at these two. Let's look at this one first. It has a long tail and this big mouth. And let's see if it's fast. Whoa, super fast. There it goes. There it goes again. And ouch, 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 ouch. Look at all the spikes on this dinosaur. I bet he's super duper fast. Whoa. So fast. Really fast. Whoa, these dinosaurs are so fast. This is super duper fun. Okay, we have two more dinosaurs to go. We have this purple slime with a purple dinosaur on top. Look how squishy. So many colors inside. And let's see if we can give it a big head. Put all the beads up there. Oh no, his head is staying small, but all the beads are popping out. Time to see what's in this purple slime. More dinosaurs. We have this green dinosaur. Rawr, rawr. Going in the slime. We have a red dinosaur. Rawr. Going in the slime. And look, this dinosaur has purple on it, just like our purple slime. Rawr, rawr. And in it goes. So we need to cover all of these up and take our squishy and start squishing. So squishy and what's under the slime? I see something sticking out right here. Oh, and there's something right there. And I think this will be the face. Oh, look at that face. Oh, it was eating some slime. Let's get it out of the slime. Whoa, look at this guy. Look at those teeth. Look at those stripes. And let's see how fast he is. So fast. There he goes. And back again. Oh, just one more super slimy dinosaur slime bottle to go. That's right, Phoebe. And this has red slime and a red dinosaur. It looks like a T-Rex. Look how squishy his belly is. I don't know if we can make his head bigger. No, the beads don't squish up there. Okay, it's time to see what's in the slime. Whoa, T-Rex, stand up. Whoa, I think he's just going to lie down. And here we go. Look at those dinosaurs. I see red dinosaurs. Rawr, rawr. Jumping in this line. Another red dinosaur. Rawr. Jumping in the slime. And it looks like we have a black T-Rex. Rawr. Diving in the slime. Okay, dinosaurs, I need to cover you up and see if this red slime is magical when we squeeze our T-Rex. Squeeze, squeeze. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze the T-Rex. And whoa, what is under all this slime? Another dinosaur. And it has red on it, just like our slime. It has one two, three horns on it, and I bet it's super fast. Yes, it is. Here we go again. And again. This dinosaur is out of control. I think that dinosaur is super happy to have all of his friends back. I think so too, Phoebe. I hope you all had fun watching. And we hope you have a 
fizzy fantastic day. We will see you next time. Fizzy, Phoebe, there's something I want to show you. What? Dinosaurs! That's right. We have some dinosaurs trapped in ice. Oh, no! But I have a special way to get them out. Oh, let's see, let's see. So under these cups, there are dinosaurs trapped in ice. Come on out, dinosaurs. Come on out. I have hot water right here, and I'm going to try to melt the ice using these droppers. Well, that doesn't sound too difficult. Well, the only thing is, Fizzy. Yeah, what is it? I need to avoid that guy. Whoa! Oh! Whoa, dragon, be a good dragon. I'm gonna load my dropper up with water and start dripping it on the ice. I think it's starting to work. No, don't go near the dragon. Ah, ah. I see some little dinosaur feet. Ah, Ooh, that's some cold ice. Let me keep pouring this on there and save our dinosaurs. If we can just get this ice to crack all the way around, we can get everyone out. Almost there. Come on, ice. Come on, ice. Crack. Woo! I have a cold hand. Oh, no. Please be good. No. No. Please be good. I almost have the dinosaurs out. No. There's ice around their necks. I need to... Ah! Help them. You behave back there. Let me melt away this ice right here. And I think to finally set them free, I'm going to dump a bunch of hot water on the ice. And now, break them free! Okay, I'm putting away my blue dropper. Hey, that matched the, whoa, blue ice. And I'm going to get out a T-Rex. Oh, maybe he likes the T-Rex. Whoa, the yellow ice just dropped. Here we go, another T-Rex. This one, this one is orange. And our last dinosaur is out. But we still have two more chunks of ice. And one cranky dragon. I'll use the green dropper on the green ice. I'm gonna work really quickly and try to get all of these dinosaurs out of the ice. Looks like we need more water. More water. They're almost out. We got out this pterodactyl. Yes, we got out another dinosaur. Little dinosaur, you are free. I'll use the yellow dropper on the yellow ice. Okay, time for lots of water on this ice. I see little dinosaur feet. Come on out, little dinosaur. Come on out. You're free. And we got another dinosaur out. Last dinosaur, you're out of there. Woohoo! Way to save all the dinosaurs, Miss Hands. Let's take a close look at them. Why are you 
so dressed up? Because I am now a fizzy the paleontologist. Paleontologist? What's that? It's a special kind of scientist who studies life on Earth through fossils and, well, dinosaur eggs. Ooh, that's cool. Let's keep looking for eggs. Okay, eggs, where are you? Where are you? Whoa, that's not an egg. That's a dog. And what's this over here? What? What? That's not an egg. That's a lifeguard. Um, excuse me, can I help you? Yes, maybe you can. Have you seen any dinosaur eggs? No, no dinosaur eggs. I don't think they actually exist. Oh, they do. And there's a dinosaur mama, and she's really sad that she lost her eggs. Hello? 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 Has anyone, Has anyone seen, seen dinosaur, dinosaur eggs, around, eggs the around the pool? The pool. No? no? Okay. okay. I, didn't, I think didn't think so. Yeah, no dinosaur eggs around here. Do you happen to have another pool around here? Yeah, the baby pool. It's over there to the left. <gasps> Great! Thank you! Let's go, Phoebe! Let's go! It looks like this cute little doggy has found something. Or there's the baby pool, but it's just covered in sand. Let me have a closer look. There's sand, and then... <gasps> Do you see what I see? Busy! It's dino eggs! Yes, it is! Miss Hands, let's get those dino eggs! Good girl, way to find the dino eggs! Let's go ahead and brush some of the sand off of this egg. <gasps> it is a dinosaur egg! There's one. Gotta dig under all this sand. Two... Oh, 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 here's another one. Three. And is there one more under here? Yes, that's four dinosaur eggs. All right, we have all these eggs. Let's take them back to the dinosaur mama. Tell me something. Oh, she's a little worried that the eggs have not hatched yet, and she wants us to help her. Okay, Fizzy, but I'm not sure how I can hatch a dinosaur egg. Oh, you may need a little Fizzy magic. Fizzy, fizzy Wizzy, Bubbizzy, Bob. Oh, cool. Thank you, Fizzy. So Fizzy gave us some tools to crack into these dino eggs. Let's try to find a little crevice right here. And we'll just hammer into the eggs. We're getting somewhere with these little tools. I'm being very careful. Don't worry, Mama. I'm being careful. I won't hurt your dino babies. We have a hole. Can we see anyone yet? No, not yet. I can see why the babies are having a hard time hatching out of their eggs. These eggs are very hard to get into. Don't worry, Mama. I'm working as fast as I can. Oh, she's trying to tell you something. She said, put them in water. Uh, put them in water? Oh, I can help. Fizzy, Fizzy Wizzy, 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 Wow. Wow. Thanks, Fizzy. Oh, she laid them in a pool because she knew they needed water. What a smart dinosaur, Mama. So the water is going to make this egg softer. And it'll be easier for me and the dino babies to crack this egg. I hear something. I think the dinosaur baby's trying to come out. Come on, little dino baby. I'm going to help you. I can't see anything yet, but we're almost to the dinosaur. <gasps> Look, I see a little tail and little legs. I'm going to be very careful. Don't worry, dino mama. I almost got your baby. <gasps> Here comes your dinosaur baby. <gasps> okay, we need to rinse it off a little bit and see what kind of dinosaur this is. Here's our baby dinosaur. It's an ankylosaurus. And here's a picture of an ankylosaurus. This dinosaur was covered in thick, bony plates that help keep it safe from other dinosaurs. Even though it was super tough, ankylosaurus ate only plants. Rawr! Okay, we're gonna put this little baby with mama. Mama, mama, mama. This is the most amazing thing I have ever seen. Let's find more dinosaur babies. We need to get to work because we have three more eggs. And three more babies to find. Let's let this little egg sit in the water. We'll put the other ones in here and they can just wait until it's their turn to hatch. Okay, and while we wait for these eggs to soak for a little bit, I have a big surprise for you. I have my very own dragon. There she is. 
This is Trixie. She has a lot in common with dinosaurs. But she's not a dinosaur. She's a type of reptile called a bearded dragon. She has scales just like dinosaurs. She even has these sharp pokey ones for protection. She has long claws like a dinosaur. She eats plants just like the ankylosaurus. But she also eats bugs too. She loves worms and roaches. Okay, let's crack into those eggs, Trixie. It's so much easier to crack into these. Whoa, when they've been in the water. And hey, I see a little dinosaur head. Come here, little dinosaur baby. Wow, here's one little dinosaur baby. Let's find out what it is. We have an Elasmosaurus. Look at the long neck and this little tail. Let's find out more about it. Yes, Mama, I'm giving you your baby, don't worry. Elasmosaurus, look at that neck. It's a giant marine reptile that uses its flippers and tail to swim the seas during the age of the dinosaurs. Its long neck let it sneak up on other animals and take a bite without having to go too close. Plus, the Elasmosaurus used its long, thin teeth to trap fish. Okay, Mama, yes, I know, I know. You're eager to see your little babies. So we're going to dig right in to this next egg and find the next little baby. Whoa, I see a red baby in here. Look, let's get this baby out. Come on, little baby, don't be scared. We're gonna clean you up. This little red dinosaur is a Cyconia. Look at all those spikes on it. Okay, mama, here comes your baby. Here's a Cyconia. The Cyconia have complex nasal tubes. That means their nose and secondary ridges of bone, indicating they lived in a hot, humid environment. They have salt glands behind their nostrils so that would be right behind here, allowing them to breathe moist air when they are in a dry environment. So cool. Yes, mama, I know, I know. You're ready to get to your last little baby here. So let's find your last baby. Will it be a T-Rex, a Triceratops? We'll have to wait and see. I see a tail right here. Okay, I'm going to gently dig around our little baby dinosaur and get this one out. This one has a very long neck. Whoa, do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Let's go clean it up. This little green dinosaur is a Diplodocus. Long neck and a long tail. Okay, mama, here you go. Here's a Diplodocus. They have such long tails. Look, and the neck is as long as the tail. The Diplodocus has a huge body shape, long neck and tail, and strong limbs. That means these legs are very strong. It was considered the longest dinosaur many years ago. Its size is sufficient to deter predators such as Allosaurus and horned dragons. So that means because it's so big, it scared away other dinosaurs. All right, Mama, are you happy? from Jurassic World. Inside we had a book and wear your own dino horns. Oh, that is amazing. Look, you can pop these out and put them on your ear, just like this person in the picture. It doesn't work so well in fizzy. That's right, because I don't have ears. Wait, how can I hear?
here. Ah, oh, one of life's mysteries. Let's see what's in this book. Look, there's a place to write your name and this adorable little dinosaur down here. Plus an egg. Look at these guys. It looks like they're ready to learn about dinosaurs. It gives lots of cool information about horned dinosaurs. You might think that dinosaurs who had horns used them for fighting or defending against other dinosaurs who were predators. However, scientists believe that the horns on these dinosaurs were just for looks and to attract mates, kind of like how a peacock uses its feathers. Who knew there were dinosaurs that just wanted to show off? Look at these show offs. So there's so many cool pictures in here. We see our old pal, the Triceratops in here. It shows them from big to small. Look at this fierce meat eater. The Carnotaurus' his name means meat eating bull. Here's the Triceratops. It has the largest teeth of any plant eating dinosaur. With a pretty high danger level though. Sinoceratops is right here. It was primarily an herbivore. That means it ate mostly plants. Its name means Chinese horned face. Whoa, what a cool face. That was so cool. And I already learned a lot about horned dinosaurs. Now, let's open up a dino egg. Woo! Since our books are bags number one through four, our eggs start with bag number five. Look, it tells us what's inside. It's a Tyrannosaurus Rex, also known as a T-Rex, rawr! Let's get into this. Here's our little speckled egg. Oh, there's a little hole in there. Oh, I see the Jurassic Park logo on there and let's get cracking. Oh, here's our little T-Rex. Rawr, rawr, rawr! Let's get him out of the bag. Here's our little T-Rex. They are well known for having itty bitty, tiny little arms big giant heads and teeth, and their big feet. If I push on the tail, we have a ferocious baby T-Rex. He can go hang out under the tree. Let's hop into book number two, Armored Dinosaurs. This one has a punch out, and you can wear it like a ring or a finger puppet. Well, we love puppets around here. Let's check this out. Here I am, I'm coming for you. Roar, roar, roar. Let's see what's inside of this armored dinosaur book. Many dinosaurs developed armor to defend themselves against ferocious predators. Look how ferocious that guy looks. Okay, that one doesn't look very ferocious. That one looks pretty cute. There's the Ankylosaurus, little tiny cutie down there. Stegosaurus, whoa, that guy is big. And the Stegymaloc, whoa, that is a fierce head. The Ankylosaurus was a plant eater. Oh, look at that little face. He had spiky armor from his skull all the way down to the end of his tail. Stegosaurus, whoa! Beware the spikes at the tip of its tail were as sharp as a sword. But the danger level is only medium. Stegosaurus means roofed lizard. This is also an herbivore, meaning it only eats plants. The Stegomolac has a medium danger level, but it looks very terrifying. <laughs> okay, it actually looks a little bit like a goat, which is kind of cute. It was as fast as an ostrich. Are ostriches very fast? Yes, they are pretty fast. Ooh, all right, it is egg time. Let's open bag number six, and we have Bumpy the Ankylosaurus. Ooh, he's so bumpy. Let's break into this egg and see little Bumpy. Oh, little Bumpy, you're so cute. Look at all this cuteness here. This one almost looks like a beaver turtle dinosaur. Does that make any sense? Well, it is very cute and if you pull on its tail, it moves, but you can also just push on its back and that makes its head and its tail move. Book number three is about big dinosaurs. Who doesn't love a big dinosaur? Oh, look at the neck on this, guys. Some of the biggest 
Plant eaters eat as much as one ton of food a day. That's a pile of plants bigger than a bus. All right, guys, we have some big guys here. We have the Brachiosaurus, and he is 70 feet long and 40 feet tall. Aptosaurus is 90 feet long and 20 feet tall. And look how scary this guy is. Mosasaurus, 71.8 feet long. That's a long dinosaur. Apatosaurus here weighed more than a small jet. Wow, look at the pop-up. That is so super cool. The Mosasaurus was ginormous and ate everything in its path. Oh, look, it was aquatic. It's eating a great white shark. Look how big it is compared to the great white shark. And look at the danger level, very high. Stay away from this guy. Okay, they're not around anymore. But if they were around, stay away from this guy. It was as long as a semi trailer. You know those giant trucks you see on the road? Yeah. And you can match the dino tracks. Izzy knows a certain dinosaur he would not like to find if he was swimming in the water at the beach. Whoa! That guy was amazing. Uh, speaking of amazing, can we open up this egg, please, please, please? Yes, we can, Fizzy. Woohoo! Let's dig in to bag number seven Toro the Carnotaurus. All right, let's get in here. We have our egg, and we're gonna. Crack into it, ooh, here he is. This guy has tiny little arms like the T-Rex, even smaller. Look at those teeth, and what happens? <gasps> when we press the tail, roar, roar, roar! I'm hungry. All right, little buddy, we'll have to find some food for you. Thanks so much, roar! Well, these guys are hanging out back there, looking pretty cute, and we're ready to dive into our last book. It's bag number four, Ferocious Dinosaurs. Ferocious Dinosaurs! Fizzy ah! is just a book. Oh, okay, let's see it. So this book also comes with these little pop-outs, and we can attach the legs to this ferocious dinosaur. After we pop them out, we just slide them right in place here. And it looks kind of funny. Rawr! I'm a paper dinosaur! All right, we'll set him back there so he's just hanging out by the rocks. And let's look at these ferocious dinosaurs. It says that they would be quite frightening because most of them were simply enormous. That means huge, very big. And they can have incredibly sharp teeth and claws. We have the Velociraptor. This guy looks teeny tiny compared to our T-Rex in the middle. Oh my, he does look ferocious. And down here are Baryonyx. Oh, we're starting with the T-Rex. His danger level is high. I bet, and his teeth are up to nine inches long. His name means King Tyrant Lizard. Oh, Trixie, look out. There's another lizard in town. So if you ran into these, you should not move because its vision was based on movement. So if he stayed still, he may not be able to find you. You can find the dino tracks here. It's the Velociraptor. Very high danger level. Okay, so he's smaller than the T-Rex, but this dinosaur was considered the most intelligent dinosaur. And they hunted in packs. Oh no, so there would be a whole bunch of them. Oh, that's scary sus. And this dino was a carnivore, meaning they ate meat from other animals and other dinosaurs. Dino, dino, where are your eggs? So this is a little egg hunt page. Oh, Baryonyx, look at this guy. Its head looked like a crocodile and it had the hunting style of a bear. It would use its powerful claws to sweep rivers and lakes for a fish. It has a high danger level. Its name means heavy claw. Time for the final egg. Let's get hatching. We're gonna get hatching and cracking. We have the Triceratops in bag number eight. All right, little Triceratops, come on out and play. Rawr! Somebody's got a wobbly, wiggly, jiggly head. <laughs> Look at this guy. Oh, those are some big horns. Look at his head up here. And if we push on his tail, 
<laughs> we can make his head wiggle around. But I think it's even more fun to give him a little shake. Whoa! All right, he's going over here. I feel a little bad knowing that the T-Rex may eat these guys. So uh, let's hide some of them. Everybody stay very still and the T-Rex won't find you. Where did everybody go? Timmy, Timmy, Timmy! Yes, Missy! Today we're going back in time. Oh, I'm so excited! Say it with me! Fizzy! Wizzy! Boozy! Bop! Whoa, Fizzy, where are we? We are in prehistoric times with the dinosaurs! Hello! Ah! Why did we come here, Fizzy? It doesn't seem very safe. It's okay, they're friendly, and we're going to sing a fun dinosaur song! Hooray! Dinosaur finger, dinosaur finger, where are you? Roar! 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 Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Uh-oh, Fizzy, Miss Hands, I think we have company. A shark! Two sharks! Uh-oh! Uh-oh, that shark looks a little hungry! And I think it wants to eat the dinosaur finger! Uh-oh! I have an idea! Dinosaur lollipop, dinosaur lollipop, here it is! Here you go, little sharky. Here's a dinosaur lollipop since you're so very hungry. Okay, shark, let's see if you ate all of the lollipop. There we go. Oh, it's all gone. I guess he's full. Great, now that he's full, we can continue our song. Here we go. Dinosaur finger, dinosaur finger, where are you? Roar, roar, roar! Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Uh-oh, that looks like a hungry shark! Oh no, he's so hungry! Good news, I have another dinosaur lollipop, dinosaur lollipop, here it is! Mr. Shark, here you go! Oh, you got the lollipop! And let's see if he ate the whole thing. Okay, okay, let's get that lollipop. He did eat the whole thing. He must be full now. Hooray, more dinosaur finger song. Dinosaur finger, dinosaur finger, where are you? Roar, roar, roar. Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Tight. But we have a dinosaur lollipop, dinosaur lollipop, here it is. Are you hungry? Yes, you are so hungry. And you ate the whole thing again. He must be full now. So let's keep singing. Dinosaur finger, dinosaur finger, where are you? Roar, roar, roar. Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Uh-oh! That shark is hungry again! Uh-oh, quick! Somebody feed the shark! Mr. Shark! Here's another dinosaur lollipop, dinosaur lollipop, here it is! Are you hungry? Yes, you are, you're so hungry! Oh, it looks like you ate the whole thing, let's see! It's all gone again. You must be full. And now we can finally finish the dinosaur song. Here we go. Dinosaur finger, dinosaur finger, where are you? Roar, roar, roar. Here I am, here I am. How do you do? Uh-oh. This chomp, shark chomp, is still chomp, hungry. Chomp, 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 okay, chomp. Mr. Shark, I have one more and then we need to finish this dinosaur song. Here you go, we have a blue dinosaur lollipop, dinosaur lollipop, here we go! Are you hungry? Are you hungry? Yes, you are! 
So very hungry. Okay, let's see if you ate the whole thing. Oh no, he doesn't want to let go. Oh, he did eat the whole thing. Oh, now we can really finish this song and then it's time for some fizzy magic. Dinosaur finger, dinosaur finger, where are you? Here we are, here we are, all on your hand. One dinosaur, two dinosaurs, three dinosaurs, four dinosaurs, five dinosaurs. And now Fizzy says, Fizzy, Wizzy, Bobizzy, Bop! It's a dinosaur hand! And not just one, but two dinosaur hands! Dinosaur hands, dinosaur hands, where are you? Here we are, here we are, how do you do? Yay! Phoebe, are you excited to go to the zoo? Yes, I'm so super excited! I can't wait to see all the animals! Okay, we're leaving in five minutes! I need to go get ready! Oh, I cannot wait. Miss Hands, can we play a game to pass the time? Yes, Phoebe. I have a little game for us to play. Awesome sauce! So what's the game called? This game is called, Will You Find This Animal on the Farm? <laughs> no, that's an elephant! <laughs> We're not going to see one of those at the farm. Very good, Phoebe. What animal is next, Miss Hands? It's a... Zebra! No, we're not going to see one of those at the farm either. Very good, Phoebe. Oh, Miss Anne, that's a giraffe. We don't usually see giraffes on a farm either. Very good, Phoebe. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, 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 ah. oh, it's a silly monkey. This monkey is super cute, but I don't think we're going to see it on the farm. Okay, two more animals for you, Phoebe. That's right, Phoebe. Oh, I just cannot wait to go. It's time to go. Yay! Let's, Let's go, go to the, the farm. farm. We're at the farm. Wait a minute. Those horns are super, duper tiny. Well, this is no regular farm, Phoebe. It isn't. No, it's a little animal finger puppet farm. Oh, this is going to be so much fun! Miss Hands, give us a hand! Okay, Fizzy and Phoebe, let's see what we find in these colorful, tiny little barns. Hey, Phoebe, what color is the number one barn? Oh, we get to learn colors too? Yes, Phoebe. Okay, um, the first one, number one is red! Okay, let's see what's inside of the number one red barn. Something with red on its head, but it's yellow. It's a little chicken. Chicken finger, chicken finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Phoebe, what color is the number two barn? The number two barn is yellow. Yes, it is yellow. And let's see what's inside. It looks like a little yellow duck. Duck. Finger, duck, finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? And Phoebe, what color is the number three barn? Ooh, the number three barn is blue, just like Fizzy. That's right, the number three barn is blue. And what do we have inside? We have a little pink pig inside. Pig finger, pig finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? <coughs> okay, Phoebe, what color is the number four house? Hmm, that color is green! That's right, the number four barn is green. And what's inside? A green frog. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Frog finger, frog finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Okay, Phoebe, how about the number five barn? What color is it? 
Ooh, that one is purple! Yes, the number five barn is purple. What's inside? We have a little dog inside. Ruff, ruff, ruff! Dog finger, dog finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Ruff, ruff, ruff! And Phoebe, what color is the number six barn? Ooh, that color is brown! That's right, the number six barn is brown. And what's inside? It's a brown horse! Nee! Horse finger, horse finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Nee! Nee! Ooh, Phoebe, this one's kind of tricky. What color is the number seven barn? Ooh, the number seven barn? That's teal! That's right, Phoebe, good job! Thanks! Let's see what's inside of the number seven teal barn. It looks like a cow! Moo! Moo! Cow finger, cow finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you moo? Moo, moo, moo! Oh boy, Phoebe, bar number eight. I know you know this color. Ha, yes, that's pink. Pink like Phoebe. Yes, and let's see what's inside of the pink number eight barn. I see some pink in the ears. It's a little rabbit. And it's hopping along. Rabbit finger, rabbit finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Hippity hop, hippity hop, hippity hippity hop. And Phoebe, do you know what color the number nine barn is? Oh yes, that barn is Orange! Yes, it is. And let's see what's inside of the orange barn. <gasps> Something with orange on it. It's a cat! Mew, mew, mew! Cat finger, cat finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Mew, 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 mew. And there's just one barn left. What color is the number 10 barn, Phoebe? Ooh, that's a little tricky, but that color is gray! Awesome job, Phoebe! You got them all correct! Woohoo! And now let's see what's inside of the gray number 10 barn. It is a sheep. Bah, bah, bah. Sheep finger, sheep finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Bah, bah, bah! Oh, Miss Hands, you know what you need to do now that you have all ten animals. Oh, I know, Fizzy. Animal finger song! Animal fingers, animal fingers, where are you? Here we are, here we are, how do you? A chicken, a duck, a pig, a frog, a dog, a horse, a cow, a rabbit, a cat, and a sheep. Oh, Fizzy, I had so much fun at the farm. Me too, Phoebe. And I hope you enjoyed watching. And I hope you have a Fizzy fantastic day. We will see you next time. All together now. Fizzy, Fizzy Wizzy, Wizzy, Wizzy Bo Busy Bop.